Hey guys, it's Maxi, and in this video, I'm gonna be breaking down the thought process on how to pop off and rank like a Radiant Jet one trick. Okay. So you, know, do you flash me to Sandra here? Let's just walk. Yeah, so I'm gonna flash. Just done with that. We're gonna walk. We're gonna walk. I'll let you know. Meow. <laughs> what does that mean? Excuse me. <laughs> After meowing my way towards sand and a split towards ace site, the main thing you always want to be as a jet main is really hard to kill. The more annoying that you are to take out, the easier time that your team has to follow you out. You gotta put some thought into it when you're gonna play like a psychopath jet. Listen to this next clip where I decide where I'm gonna be entering depending on who we're gonna go against. Why? Wow. I think we go A. I don't, wanna, I don't wanna hit B against a cypher. I feel like B, a cypher is always tag B. If we know you know flash on rip? Uh, yeah. So that's the plan. My arm is flashing this close angle, and then we're all gonna be bum rushing off that. Ooh, he's a gamer. He's close. He's close. He is a gamer. He went through the smoke. Oh, no. Okay. I noticed that the enemy had a two duelist comp. Something that's gotten really popular is fighting A main off the start. So with that common knowledge and just seeing what type of comp they have, I just make the gamble and we profit from it. I want to be absolutely sure that I can capitalize off my omens flash. I can't let it go to waste. The second I get one guaranteed pick, I just updraft and try to get into a safe position so my teammate and I can peek the jet and just take him out together. This next clip, I showcase that there is a smart way to run through smokes. Pay attention to how I ask for some sort of utility from my Sova. He ends up using his ultimate and that bit of distraction is enough for me to walk through the smoke and make a play. No. Can you dart the run out? Yep. On site. Oh shit, I put one button. They're on uh, they're behind me, stairs. Spike down B. One guy B main and the other guy made side. Yeah, I'm gonna go see. Louis flanking right now. Last guy site, uh I mean uh, main, 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 not side, not side, not side, not side. Nice. Guy jumped up there. Bro, 74 and jets. Last player standing. Uh, no charges left. One enemy remaining. Four. Whenever you're in a 1v1 clutch, something that you gotta understand is that the majority of the time, patience will be your greatest strength. Take your time clearing every single angle that you need to. Don't rush it. Especially if you have a lot of time to work with, you gotta make sure you don't let this guy know what you're cooking up. If this guy doesn't know where you're coming from, this guy's probably gonna be overthinking himself to the grave. This guy probably thought I rotated to B after getting the bomb because he just assumed that I rotated towards A, and it allows for me to get an easy bomb plant. It's absolutely crucial that you minimize the information that you're relaying to the other dude. It's a 1v1, but technically I would consider it a 1v2 because this guy's not only against you, he's against time. So if he has to take that extra second to try to clear every single little corner, every little second that he takes is an extra second that takes against the bomb, making your life easier. This guy makes a footstep and then after that, it's easy to play off it. <laughs> As a jet main, you gotta be unselfish and unflinching. Hey, can we meow? Here. Three, two, one, meow. The meow strat that we cooked up falls through because there isn't a guy playing sands. The second that I see that my teammates are fighting some guys A main, I turn tail and go help them out. Oh, over there! One enemy what the remaining. fuck? If you want to be a top tier jet main, try practicing this updraft dash into the generator through the smoke. Notice how I play safe and I hold for overextensions until my teammate gets picked off crossing. Then that's my cue to spring into action and to try to get a trade to bring it back down to a 4v4. Ow. So I do that, I get instantly one tap. The second I get a pick on this twerp, these guys know exactly where I'm at. So I toss a jet smoke to try to buy me some cover so I can lurk around, lurk out, and to try to get a cheeky angle on somebody. Copy, I think. Nice, nice, nice. I have a camera 
Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. By judge and like kill the sage on B if we like omen flash it. I could dash satchel. at him. Ooh, yeah, we just fly at this guy. Just do it. Okay, I have a judge. Right. Let me go first. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Third case. Huge burst from you. Nice guys. <laughs> nice. In this clip, this is why team play is extremely important. Pay attention to how my teammates and I use our utility to counter their push. We agree to dodge the standard early breach zone and toss a grenade off his flash and then swing while the grenade is at their feet. The grenade is applying pressure to them while we're also applying pressure to them. Sometimes they're gonna be jumping around trying to dodge the nade and then we get some easy picks. B main. Fucking kills idiot. Hey, what is that B main? Like, what is that? I don't know. Oh, they all three feet glass up there. Remember, the hallmark for a really good jet main is to be extremely hard and annoying to kill. I'm hiding up like here. Oh, I got mine. I got mine. He's running at me. And I know it's too easy to On site planning, please. This is swinging me. Yes, I know. Planner, planner, planner. He fucked up. I love him. I'm the greatest fucking player. He fucked up. Yeah, was it the red one? You need it. I'm gonna just go in here. Down on the left. Under, under. Spike down. B. There. Nice job. That was the guy that was under. You're. I don't want to get it. Okay, okay. Flash that. One enemy remains. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Why are you looking at me? He's not watching the planner. He's just fucking. Arger. One hall, one hall. He did this too. Two hall, two hall, two hall. Two hall. There's two. Did you get him, I got one for sure. One, one, one. One seventy, eighty, seventies. Right. In this clip, we decided contact up A, which essentially just means that we buddy system up, keep our guns out, and clear and walk all the way towards site until something causes us to pounce on them. In this clip, it's a trip. We shoot and then explode from there. These plays are especially good against really passive teams that don't really fight for A main control. If you burst out onto site without them having a chance to call for a rotation, it's an easy site hit. You're a hoe. <laughs> Wanna push up the spawn? Yeah, yeah. man. I'm a dog. Fucking. Oh, sweet. Oh, I sucked him. It's gonna be art. Watch your art. A bottom? So main. Oh my nice. god. This is today's code word for a chance of free coaching. If you happen to have a VOD of you playing Jet, hit me up in my Discord. The link is in the description down below. I'm not really good at teaching and all that stuff, so I'm really working on my coaching right now. I try to learn how to be better and how to make it into content, so please bear with me guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys have been looking to get coached by me but haven't gotten the chance to, I highly suggest you watch the free coaching course I made for Jet Mains for the map Ascent. 